everyone hope you've all had a lovely and blessed thursday um it's been a bit miserable here in the uk yesterday it was like a heat wave today it was just miserable anyway i thought i'd just hop on because i've just finished this beautiful partial of a chicken and um i'm just really impressed with it and it just goes to show that sometimes you know with partials people think to themselves oh no we don't get value for money because it's only a partial it's not a full drill but you can get some really really lovely partials as well and this was in one of my haul videos um one of my unboxing videos i think a week or so ago um so i just wanted to run through quickly um what what i thought of it and some other bits and bobs that i've got from ebay today so i don't know if you can see all the sparkles on this i mean look it's just gorgeous and i have to say have to say that i just love these let me just turn this light down because it's a bit bright um but i am just loving a bit oh, it won't go down guys hang on a second bear with me bear with me is that a bit too dark maybe a bit brighter there okay so i am really loving these ones i don't know what they're called but if you look at them and you move around they sort of change color and i just think they're just beautiful they really are just beautiful and um yeah i just think for what you pay for this like two three pound i think it's worth it personally i am going to be putting this on a canvas um on a backing canvas thing a frame a wooden frame so i will be doing that sorry you just saw a bit of those uh, <laughs> months of the year and all that for my youngest one but yeah i have just bulk by a few 25 by 25 oh the lights just died on me sorry hang on there we go don't know why i just done that um yes yeah, so i have just purchased a few canvases plain canvases from amazon 25 by 25 and i will be just basically sticking this over it and hoping for the best because my daughter is smitten with it and i can see why because i just think as i said this is just it's just gorgeous i really do like it i mean what's there not to like it might be a partial but quite a lot of it is uh, i think it's a it's a good partial you know sometimes you can just get a partial where just one um one part of the picture is just diamond painted and then the rest isn't but <clears throat> sorry my voice is going i think this is a, a really beautiful picture actually and you can get another one which i am thinking of going online later and buying it i won't <laughs> i gave that one away but um be quiet about that one because <laughs> no one wants to see any more diamond paintings i've still got another order coming by the way but shh you don't know about that um yeah so as i was saying that with this one there is another one i think it is a set so the other one has two chickens sort of like either side facing each other sort of thing and i just think i might have to go and get that <laughs> i might have to do it guys even though i've got quite enough to be getting on with but you know such is life such is life i just really enjoyed doing this one um and i wanted to show you what the leftover drills are so as you can see i have got can you see that i have got quite a lot leftovers and do have some of those big ones i've got three of those big ones so let me just put you down so i've got three of uh 
move this back now. I actually have three of these beautiful, um, I don't even know what they're called. I'm going to have to look up the name for them. So I'll show you quickly. I do love these ones. I just think they're just beautiful. Really lovely. Can you see that there? That's better. And I've got three of them spare and then I've got quite a few of the orange pearl teardrop ones which again they are one of my favorites as well so I'm quite pleased with that that I've got um I've got some spares of them left over um so yeah there's that one completed this one will definitely be going up in my room, as I said. And um, just put in a bit of Mr. Muscle, Mr. Muscle window glass cleaner just helps as well. If there are any dust, there wasn't much on this, to be honest with you. But I always do it, you know, before I seal it. I am going to seal it with Mod Podge. Um, I usually use the gloss one. And um, yeah. I I know some people say it takes away the shine, but I in my experience I don't think it does. Um it could be just um it could be just a preference. But anyway, so moving swiftly on, so there's that one completed now, and I wanted to show you also what I received today in my Amazon delivery. Um, because I did mention last night on the video that I was, I'd ordered this stand, tabletop stand thing, um, because I didn't want a big massive easel in the, in the living room because I really don't have the space for it. So I went online and I saw, I'm just going to collapse it. I saw this wooden box thingy majiggy <laughs> and it is for a tabletop let me just release my magnets put this one over here in seal and um yeah so basically this is let me zoom you out a bit this is a box it's got a little handle and basically what you do it's like a tabletop easel and that's what i had the painting on and i've i used it this evening to diamond paint and because i do struggle with my back and my shoulders like most of us do um when you reach a certain age and i just saw this and i thought it's small it's compact and i'm going to show you something else that it does as well which i think you just you just literally lift it up let me move it back a bit you literally whoops there we go literally just lift it up and tighten the inside screws she says this seems a lot easier before There we go it's tightening now so you literally just lift it up and tighten it to whatever position you find comfortable it does come higher than that and also it is actually there's another little thingy majig that you undo and you can lift this bit right up so if you were doing a 30 by 40 I'll put it on the maximum and see. So that's the biggest that it actually goes to. I'm going to lift you up, guys, because I don't think you can see it. So, sorry, the parrot is out. It goes up high so you can actually have it for a big one, you know, a big massive diamond painting if you wish. The only thing is, is obviously it's not wide enough, but... 
I don't do that many large ones to be honest with you I do like my 30 by 40s and my um, 30 by 30s that's sort of like what I enjoy doing the most um, I am doing still the last supper it's taken me forever to get it completed but I will get it completed but anyway so moving on to this and also so let me just bring this down but I thought that was really clever personally I think it's a clever design um, so also the next thing this is a brilliant part of it all guys let me move you down there we go that's perfect so look at this basically since I've been diamond painting I've been carrying all these bits and bobs around in like a little ziplock bag and it's just been getting ripped and all sorts and you do acquire a few little tools as you go along as you can see so this is just great for storing all your little tools your trays your pens your washi tape everything i mean like i've even got my little roller in there and i just think that is a really good idea to have on the back of an easel you know I, i'm just really impressed with it it was a bit expensive but it is solid wood so you'd have to be careful and it does have quite a good handle on it as well um it was 16.99 guys 17 pound basically in english money and i did think hmm that's a bit expensive but you know at the end of the day i plan to be using this a lot and it's great because i can now have all my tools all my washi tape everything in one place ready at hand to use so yeah i'm really happy with that i think it's an excellent bargain so you've got got all my pens here all this stuff i've even got some scissors in there you know just basically everything you need and yeah i thought i'd show you that because i think it's brilliant <laughs> personally you might not but that's just my opinion anyway so let me just collapse this down and put it away she says it is a bit fiddly but once you get the gist of it yeah should be fine there we go so let me move that out the way okay so ta -da. <laughs> the next item i didn't unbox this on on um camera because i had company this evening from my dad dear old daddy kins came over and um yeah i didn't want to film in front of him because last time he just ruined my kitten up video <laughs> and i was really really annoyed with him but anyway so this is just your standard pill boxes that i saw on um on amazon and hello hi everyone sorry about that um the phone died on me again it's always dying on me um basically all the video side of it i needed to delete to free up some more storage to film more videos anyway getting back to this so this is your standard pill box and you can use it for all sorts and yes i will be using it for kitting up they are joined they're not separate and um i was impressed with actually how much drills you can get in these boxes i know they're only small but you know they hold quite a lot to be fair and i think that this type of box and this type of um storage for drills is kind of going out of fashion now because everyone wants bigger boxes that hold more drills etc etc and um, amazon are doing 
great deals with these boxes at the moment and so I went on and I thought these will be good if you're doing a partial or a small 30 by 30 and they do I mean I done this partial and I only filled up like half just over half of the box and they come with stickers basically everything and yeah I thought that was a good good deal and I got two boxes I think together that came to about eight pound for two boxes and then this one was buy buy one get one free I think it was only about four pounds and again yeah I'm just really really happy with how much these hold I just want to check if they're the same as that one they look slightly different but it could be my eyes because it's been such a long day no I think they are the same actually yeah yeah, I was just thought these are great for doing um, the small smaller paintings, you know. And they do hold a fair amount. So, yeah. I bought them too and I'm happy with those. And again, they come with all their stickers and all that. So, I will be doing a kitten up video with these. A bit um later on sorry i thought i wasn't recording them but i was recording i was like oh no oh it's been too much of a long day guys too much um so yeah i will be doing a kitten up video with all these and i hope you've enjoyed this video if you do um please like subscribe and share and you know i'm just showing you basically what I do to make my diamond painting experience a bit more easier on the old back and shoulders and for it to go a bit smoother with the whole storage thing. <laughs> yeah, but you've made some great suggestions to me that I am keeping in my mind as busy as it is. Um, but anyway, I hope that you've enjoyed this video and please like, subscribe and share and I will speak to you all very very soon so take care for now and God bless you all bye